Hi there, and welcome to another exciting edition of the Ask Dr. Jack show. I am Dr. Jack Bielitz, your host, chiropractor here in Omaha, Nebraska, and we take questions and uh, give you the answers. Um, today, I had a patient that recently had a uh, pacemaker put in. Uh, and was concerned because he's heard about all the different electronic problems that people have with different electronics or walking through the airport with the metal detectors and everything like that. He wanted to know how serious this problem was. And uh, so I happened to find a really great study that was done and it'll give you a, good, a lot of good information here. So the study uh, was uh, tested on 300 patients that had either pacemakers or um, defibrillators uh, implanted into themselves and they did uh, 3,400 tests on these 300 patients so quite a few tests on each one of them and uh, th the results were really cool um, it, it uh, they used major cell phones like the uh, Samsung Galaxy uh, one from Nokia one from HTC uh, so most of the big ones were done now the biggest problem with cell phones is when the cell phone is trying to connect to the tower or it's trying to connect to a talk, call. Uh, talking on the phone doesn't really use that much energy. So those were a main part of the tests. And anyway, after that uh, battery of tests, they found out, uh, and one of the authors, I'll, I'll quote them, patients with cardiac devices can uh, use smartphones but they should not place it directly over the cardiac device. So, basically what you want to do is you want to make sure that if you are carrying your phone with you, you don't put it in your shirt pocket that's right over your heart. You don't want to hang it from your neck or on a strap or something that is anywhere in that vicinity. Um, but other than that, that is the you know biggest thing that they found uh, when they were doing these tests. I uh, hope that is of help to you. Uh, I know it was great information for me. Uh, again, if you have any questions at all, uh, call the office, 402-333-4848. You can email me at askdrjackb, that's A-S-K-D-R-J-A-C-K-B-E-E, -E, at gmail.com, or you can stop in the office and uh, we will uh, take your questions that way. Hope you have a very happy and healthy day, uh, and uh, uh, I will see you next time.